Hey everyone, RG with RG Fam Games here with a special video for you today. We have the June. It's June. Retro Game Treasure Box. Um, this one's gold. I don't know if that's, you know, usually it's a little more yellow. This just seems to be more gold than normal. See, look, you can see in the background. Yellow. 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 Is it more gold? Interesting. I don't know if that sign signifies anything or they, they just changed the box. Um, either way, so we've got our unboxing. Uh, but first, before we get to that, I want to... I got. I did a trade um, with uh, uh, Zaxxon's Gaming. Um, um, do, when we did the manual video, um, mentioned that he wanted uh, one of the manuals I had. So we just kind of initiated talks and got it traded. In two days, it was here already. I mean, man, he was fast. Um, my mine's on his way to him, so hopefully he's happy with the stuff uh, that I sent him over. But I uh, wanted to show you that, and then I've got Father's Day gifts, two quick Father's Day gifts I, I just want to share. Um, but let's go over the trade first. Um, uh, first thing I picked up, I have Rocky for the Master System. Um, you know, it's not a great game, but it's def one definitely got to have in the collection. Just got to find me a box, but happy to have that. Uh, picked up uh, NFL 94 complete in box. Look, um, I'm a big Joe Montana fan. I want every game that Joe Montana was on. I already have this game, but now I have a complete in box, and that was that's what was important to me. Uh, same with this game. This game I actually got recently in a I think it wasn't a retro game treasure box, but I uh, got an opportunity to get a complete in box version. So uh, I got Road Rash. Uh, really, really great condition. So. Um, Really happy to have that complete in box. And last but not least, as part of the trade, uh, one of my favorite games of all time um, that for some reason I don't have, but now I do, and it is Shenmue. So I always just thought I would get this in a box at some point. You know, it's a pretty common uh, Dreamcast game. I have beaten this game, played it through to its conclusion. I never finished Shenmue 2, though, and I haven't played Shenmue 3, which came out, you know, a couple years ago. Um, on my list i'll get to it someday but uh absolutely th this shenmue was revolutionary for the time just the day night cycle uh all of the art um npcs had daily routines so you had to be in the right place at the right time to find them you know if you're looking for them um you know the built-in arcade games uh that are in here um it just felt like a a, a single player game but it felt like a a fully living breathing world so love shenmue uh, i'm so happy so uh thank you nico for hooking me up uh and doing the trade um really added some nice things to my collection that i wanted i hope you enjoy um but i sent them a couple genesis games a couple nintendo games and uh one of the manuals so Thank you so much. Appreciate it. Uh, so anyone else wants to trade, if you want to trade, hit me up on Twitter. I Just DM me uh, at our genius streams. It should be in the bio or the main page here. Um, I have a lot of those manuals left. Um, so anytime you ever want to trade, just, just DM me on Twitter. And, uh, you know, I'm friendly. I'm a nice guy, you know. So um, next up, Father's Day real quick. Uh, ben decided to go to our dear friends over at respawn retro gaming in west bend uh wisconsin met our friend tony over there and he got me two all-time classic games that i've never had in the collection always wanted i love these games both of them so much uh first one is castlevania never owned castlevania at any point in my life um I never got to spend a lot of time with with this as a kid. One, because I never had it. Not a lot of my friends had it either. Um, so I never really got a chance to really play it. I never really rented it either. Uh, maybe I rented it once. So, But I never spent a lot of time with it. But then not too long ago on the Switch, I bought that Castlevania collection. And then I really spent a lot of time playing Castlevania 1. Because I'm one of those weird guys who has to play everything in order. And this is the only one I would play. I did actually, I, I played... Castlevania 4 for Super Nintendo as well. Um, but I'm obsessed with this and I have to beat this game. I love it. I love it. I love it. So happy now that I have a, a regular version. Um, so thank you, Ben, for that. And even better, even better, stay with me. 
up up down down left right ba select start there you go contra love contra love this game i used to rent i've never owned it but i've I rented it so many times and even though i could beat it with the konami code i can't beat it with the without the konami code you watch those speedrunners who can beat this on three lives tip of the hat to you because i'll never be able to do that but love this game so much i got super scene in one of a, in a box a long time ago um this is an all-time all-time classic game just like castlevania um konami i mean konami capcom some some of those companies just could do no wrong uh on the nes and this is i love it i love it so much so happy father's day to me this is uh an awesome awesome father's day gift so um i do have some awesome kids what can i say i love them so all right and now for what y'all came for the uh the gold uh retro game treasure box so let's open this bad boy up let's see what's inside thanks for we got air pillows they've been popped air pillows popped let's see what we got i feel three games i feel a genesis game i feel a super nintendo game and a nintendo game that's it just three games uh let's go genesis first genesis first one two three boom family feud do i not have family feud maybe it's for one of the other systems um love the family feud uh love the game show i've always loved the game show since i was a kid i love video game versions of the game show um i you know what i recently not too recently maybe six months maybe a year ago i think i bought it i bought that and wheel of fortune no it's jeopardy and wheel of fortune on the xbox do they have them i'm sure they have modern versions of this love the feud love the feud um so i know it's not worth much but I'm, I, I i like it i'm happy to have it We'll go Super Nintendo. Make sure I got facing the right way. Yeah, this will be facing the right way. Here we go. One, two, three. Boom. NBA Hang Time. So this is the um, successor to NBA Jam. Um, arcade port. Um, I never really played a lot of Hang Time. I played it in the arcades. I never really played the home version. Um... I think this came out a little later towards when I was in college and then I went moved on to like um you know PS1. I brought a PS1 to college with me. Um so NBA Jam, NBA Jam Tournament Edition were the ones I played the most. I never really played Hang Time, but I played it in the arcades a lot. Um so I know it's a fun game. So happy to have it. Um I think there's a lot of just like NBA Jam there's a lot of unlockable characters. Um it might be fun to go revisit those and see who all the um who all the unlockables are all right last game there's only three games so this is a small box um honestly would lead me to believe this might be a, a really good game based on the value of the other two games but we'll see who knows uh nes one two three here we go I I was even recently hunt game hunting, went to a bunch of game stores that didn't have this. Oh my gosh. Maybe the best pull I've ever gotten from, from Retro Game Treasure. I love who doesn't love? Is there a person who doesn't love Mike Tyson's punch out? If they are, I'd like to meet them because they don't exist. Um and it's Mike Tyson's punch out. It's not punch out, it's not the rebrand. You know, this is the actual Mike Tyson's punch out. We got some initials on the front. DB. I don't know who DB is, but thank you. Um, oh my god. Wow. Wow. I mean, that this is one of the best. I've never beaten Mike Tyson. I've never gotten to Mike Tyson. I can't get past Super Macho Man. That's it. I'm gonna say it. I don't care. Judge me. I can't get past Super Macho Man. Never can. I don't know why. Actually, yeah. Who's no, I don't even have I even gotten a super macho man? Or is it second bald bull that gets me? Or is it Soda Popinski? 
I don't know the order. What's the order? Um, is Soda Popinski the guy I can't get past? Or is it Super Mach? I don't know. Um, I don't know. Anyway, wow. Thank you so much, Retro Game Treasure. Huge, 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 huge uh, addition to the collection. A game that I've wanted for so long. A game that I've been searching for. Um, it's definitely been on my wish list uh, since day one. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I'm, I mean, in, in a matter of, of days, in a matter of days, look at this. Look at this. That's the, the NES collection has, has just skyrocketed value. That's amazing. I'm so happy. Um, that's, that's the box. That's, that, that's all of it. So, um, thank you so much. Thanks for watching. Let's talk about all these games. Uh, what did you get in your boxes? You know, uh, we all watch each other's videos. Can't wait to see yours. Um, talk about the, the Father's Day gifts or the trade stuff I got. I just, I want people, I don't even want to put it down. <laughs> just, uh, I'm very happy. Uh, I, I am actually going on vacation um starting tomorrow so it might be a week or so but a little bit over a week before you'll get another video um i do have a love again media box coming and i will tell you i do i teased a video one or two videos ago um that video is still coming and i will tell you that right now in the frame you can see what that video is going to be about if you can figure it out, maybe you can, maybe you can't. But uh, it isn't. It is. Um, it's definitely visible in this picture. I'll say that. So big tease, big tease. Um, if you can guess it, put it down in the comments. Um, but awesome. See you in the next video. Bye.